Hi there, my name is Mark and I'll be an instructor on this channel. So, whether you're a student, a small business owner or just someone who wants to improve their Excel skills, you've come to the right place. Subscribe to our channel and join our community of Excel enthusiasts today. Today we're going to show you how to quickly and easily insert a checkbox in Excel. Don't worry, it's really easy and we'll only need a few clicks to create it. The first step we need to do is make sure we have the developer tab on the top bar. If we don't have the cell there, we can right click anywhere on the bar, go to customize the ribbon and now we are presented with a window. We can check the box developer and press OK button. We can see we've added the tab on the top bar called developer. Let's go to this tab. Click on the checkbox insert. As we can see, Excel gives us two sets of controls that we can use. The first element is called form controls. This element is designed to be easy and quick to use. For example, if we wanted to display just a checkbox. Right below that is the active X element. This is for more advanced use and we'll come back to that later. We will however focus on the form controls element in this video tutorial. We click on the checkbox and now move down. We can see that the cursor has changed to a plus sign which means we can put the selected checkbox wherever we want. We'll paste it here. Around the checkbox as we can see we have text and a box. We can easily remove or change the text. We can make the box around the box as small or as big as we need, but we have to remember that the box is part of the checkbox. If we click anywhere within the box, our checkbox will be checked. We'll click anywhere to exit the edit mode now, but the size of the text box can cause us problems, so we'll adjust it as needed. We right click on the box, now we can simply shrink the box as we need. If we want to copy the checkbox to subsequent rows, we just click on the cell where we have the checkbox and drag its bottom corner to all the rows where we want the checkbox to be. And that's it. We have checkboxes everywhere we need them. If we need to remove the checkbox, we right click on the row we want to remove the checkbox from. This will show us the options. We click on the option cut and we're done. That was easy, wasn't it? So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video and hope you found it useful. If it was, let us know via the comments or liking. And if you're interested in any other videos on how to quickly learn to work with Excel, don't forget to give us a like and a subscribe. 